Under the Sea. That's a good song. Music people and American divers set a new record for the deepest dive in history. Victor Vescovo plunged nearly 36,000 feet in his watercraft to the lowest part of the ocean in the Pacific's Mariana Trench last month. Now, this is only the third time that humans have been able to reach the sea's extreme depths. Mola Lange spoke to Vesco Vescovo about his surprising discovery in the deepest natural trench on the planet. Mola, good morning. Please help me with his name. Victor Vescovo? Vescovo, yeah, you got okay, it. Yeah, got definitely it. a tale of adventure here. Good morning, guys. The private equity investor we spoke with is a thrill seeker, to say the least. He has skied the North and South Poles and conquered the highest peaks on all seven continents, including Mount Everest. But after reaching the highest place on Earth, he was also determined to reach the lowest. You are cleared to dive. Thank you. See you all on the other side. Fantastic. Have a good one, Victor. Deep in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, Victor Vescovo dove 35,853 feet beneath the waves. At bottom, repeat, at bottom. Breaking previous records by about 36 feet. At the bottom? Yep. Yeah! <laughs> Congratulations, Victor. Thank you. The Dallas investor spent four hours exploring the deepest known area of the planet's seabed. In a $48 million submersible, a small watercraft built to withstand the extreme pressure of the ocean's depths. We wanted to prove the capabilities of the submarine and the whole system by diving there repeatedly and really hopefully opening a door for science. Though Vescovo is the first to make it this far down, man's impact has already been felt with pieces of plastic scattered among the sea creatures. In most of the deeps that I've been down, I've seen contamination of plastic or things I can't even recognize, but they're definitely man-made, which is really unfortunate. Vescovo and his team saw a pink snailfish, multiple kinds of eel, and also discovered at least three new species. He says their genetic information could advance medical research. It feels like a, a great privilege that I was able to do this as a, as a human being. It's a great feeling just to try and, you know, help push humanity a little bit forward. That's him. He got sub on the surface. One giant dive. For mankind. Well, thank you guys. Well done. Thanks for coming to get me. <laughs> well, Vescovo's next challenge is to reach the bottom of the Arctic Ocean, which he plans to do in August. A documentary series that chronicles his expedition will air on the Discovery Channel later this year. And once he has conquered the mountains and the oceans, guys, he says his next challenge is outer space. Oh.